Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie Farming in the Philippines. Lovely, lovely day. Do you look over this way? Ugh. Right, so we've had Wilfredo in today. He's brush cut all up through the creek. Chick was a bit worried getting the food for the goat she planted because of the snakes. And there's a nice big bastard up here yesterday, we heard. So Wilfredo done all the creek through here. Now the afternoon he does the goats. So that gives Chick and I time to relax. So we went out after three and gave them all the um, bottle supplements to all the young babies, the adopted baby, and um, what do you call it? All the other ones who's got triplets and things like that, because there's always one needs extra. So even though you can't just stick them out, you know, you can't say, oh, she's got tits, you know, BTB, you know, she's got big titty bitch. So you have to supplement them, guys. You've got to really look after them. And that's why a lot of the local goats are really skinny and all that malnourished because they don't, don't have given the bottles but what happened was our last girl on heat this girl not on heat she was late going on heat now she walked back from the feeding she walked back from there to the gate so chick let her in and now she's come straight to her room okay and look her pussy is swollen she's rocking her tits gone look this morning when we looked at her we're coming to give her a bran and uh, bananas this morning and the titties like they must have gone double over size overnight. You know, it's like absolutely massive. So I think that um, I think she's going to be dropping very, very soon. Very soon. Uh, she's got no liquids coming out yet. It's definitely probably it's a nose. A nose when they position. Oh God, when they position, they get their um, they get their front paws up in their nose, and they'll just come through on that side of things. That's how they come out. Now, she had her first litter last time, and I put her in here like I did now, for example. Wasn't expecting her to drop. I worked down to the house. Tick come up 10 minutes later, and she's yelling like a little, ah, I said, what is it? You know, thinking she's seen a snake again or something, and she dropped two babies out, bang, bang. Just like that, didn't she? Yeah. Fast, within like minutes, probably 10 minutes of me leaving her. So she's in there now, she's rocking backward and forth, and like I said, the pussy's sticking out. And um, I think it's going to be, yeah. I think it's going to be for sure. So let's see, guys. Come on, guys. Game on. Dr. William is in. So I'm here, baby. Okay. It's okay, baby. It's okay. It's okay. Daddy's here. All right, let's do it, baby. Okay, Daddy. Oh, black one. <laughs> Another black betty. <laughs> Brown sugar and black betty again. My gulay. Hello, baby. Come on, let's see. It's moving already. It's the one that's giving her a hard time, always kicking. Like black betty before. Years. Okay. Hello. Hello, uh. welcome. Uh. Welcome. There's a rap uh, runs up here, hun. It's a rap. Hello, black baby. Hello, it's a small one, okay, very another. small head. Boy. Boy again? Two boys. Oh my God, so six boys and four girls, this batch. Wow. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Hey? <laughs> having, having animals, guys, and helping them deliver is such an incredible feeling. It's I tell an you. amazing experience. It's an amazing, beautiful feeling. We're so lucky, I tell you. Live your dream, guys. Live your <laughs> the dream. The ears. I love the ears. <laughs> Live your dream. Oh, mama. Gosh. That should be a bag now. Yeah. By the looks, it's the bugs. Yeah. Well, there you go, guys. 
two boys, a brown one and a black one. Now, we've had the dark ones before and they've turned out light once they've dried right off. But I'm pretty sure this is going to be a black. What did you have last time? Brown sugar and black betty? Yeah. Wow, look at that. So she's got the sack out now. That's all it says. She's only twins. So that's good. She, she really delivers good, this one. She really delivers good. The others can be um, 20 minutes in between um, dropping them out. But she, she drops them out like one after the other. Bang, bang. She's incredible, this girl. Incredible. So it's a wonderful feeling, guys. A wonderful feeling. It's a pity other people like those trolls can't do something like this and change their life, change their attitude. They'd really, really like it. Such a beautiful world. Look at that. Hey, look at that. Wow. So it's just a sack now. I'll leave that. One thing we don't do is don't pull that, let it fall out naturally. These tits. I hope she doesn't get mastitis again like last time. Last time she had the mastitis and it took me bloody ages to get her clean. Oh, look at all that. All right, let's I'll put these on the tip. Right, guys, so there you go. So she, she's still resting. She hasn't stood up yet. So um, she'll be all right. So the other little ones down here. So we'll let her just rest down. And that's it. So all the other babies have just got inside now. So we'll say see you later, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all your, all your support. Remember, hit that like button for us, please. That really helps us out and promotes us on um, videos to watch. So uh, thank you all. And remember, don't give up your dream. We live ours. It's bloody beautiful, mate.